right here, bro. I am not a ninja warrior. I want to make that clear. You guys are such stars. I am not. I'm chubby. I am. I'm, gonna, I'm afraid to fly. That's how out of shape I am now. Everybody fights to get on an airplane. Try to be first on the plane. Not me. You know what I try to do? I try to be the last guy on the plane. Because I think, how much cooler is that? Than being the first guy up there who's sitting there in first class, waiting, sipping his little mimosa, doing Sudoku. Instead, 30 minutes later, I walk on, I'm like, hey, thanks for waiting, Chief, but tell the pilot Matt Eisman has arrived. <laughs> now we can fire up this jet and let's go. The only problem is when you're the last person on the plane, everybody stares at you. And I know you're still filming me. This shirt is slimming, isn't it? I'll let you know the secret. Daddy hasn't missed many meals. I'm, I'm 6'4", 255. I am what the military calls husky. I think I'm a liability in combat. And when you walk down the aisle this size, everybody who has an empty seat next to them looks at you the same way. No. <laughs> Please, God, don't sit next to me. <laughs> they shame me! And I was just on a flight, and I get to my row, and I see the seat where, where I'm supposed to sit. And the two guys in my row, I'm the petite one. I'm, I'm the small one! These guys look like they had me for breakfast with butter. They're enormous. I sit down. And now we're all crammed in, we're pulling our shoulders together. Because you know, big guys, if we touch, like, butter forms spontaneously. It's disgusting. You go the whole flight in Korea, you're considered married. It's gross. And so we're sitting there pulling in, and we calculate between the three of us, there's 971 pounds of man meat in this single row. I know. I know. Like, we're going to take off. You're going to hear, eh, eh, eh. Eyes, we get to the left side. We're going to take out Burbank. So the steward, the only saving grace was that it was an exit row. So there was a little, there was a little, that's no, my mom calling. There's a little extra. Why are you up so early? You're chubby. She, there's a little extra leg room because I had an exit row, but it comes with great responsibility. And uh, the flight attendant comes up, are you willing and able to help in the event of an emergency? And I take it very seriously, like you do your responsibilities. And I say, yes. And she goes, what's with the tone? And I go, I'm just... I'm looking at the window and it looks a little small. I'm not sure I'll fit. The guy next to me, who's 6'7", 351, goes, don't worry. I'll make sure you fit. Oh my god! Now I'm terrified! I'm terrified this flight's gonna go down in Omaha, the fuselage is gonna fill with flames and smoke. I'm gonna be wedged in a window. That's why I have a fear of flying. <laughs>